Hi everyone, in this video we will see how to insert current date and time into database using JPA. So what a yeah in Spring Boot. So if we are going to uh, make a API and uh, we want uh, current date and time and it should be inserted automatically in databases in using JPA. So we need to uh, code in entity class this code and if i wanted the field name is last updated okay and time stamp current time stamp it should be inserted automatically so this code we will code in entity class this is my entity class uh, root planner user so here uh, all fields are there and uh, one more fields that i want to add in this is last updated and this last updated will be current time so this is the code for that so time stamp and that field name will be last updated and this is code only you have to put in your program in your project in entity class so it will automatically insert because pre persist will automatically run so uh, whenever we will call this api post post mapping whenever you call it will insert a uh, one column that name is last updated and this will be the time stamp uh, that particular time stamp uh, at that time we will run this api and that field name will be last updated so just uh, put this code in your project at the entity class so let's see run <laughs> so uh, this is the post mapping where I in a postman I just send the data this is my controller and this is the URL of a post is request and uh, I will send the blank data so as we know the time is from last updated time is time is uh, current at the time where I am running it that time is here and all this thing uh, is uh, null so all was null and last updated is inserted and ID that is auto generated so those values are inserted in JPA thank you and uh, please subscribe and maybe this will help you if you need uh, this field that will be automatically insert so this code uh, definitely work I'm sure please subscribe thank you for watching